Home to the President of the French Republic, the Elysee Palace comprises more than 350 rooms over 15,000 square metres, from the famous Cour d'Honneur in the north end and two hectares of garden in the south. It's a powerful symbol of the Republic, but that wasn't always its destiny. In 1718, the Count d'Evreux built a luxury townhouse at the entrance to Paris, between marshland, fields and meadows. The building's been transformed several times according to the tastes of each illustrious owner. It was home to Madame de Pompadour, favourite mistress of Louis XV, as well as the Duchess of Bourbon before the fall of the monarchy. Napoleon's last imperial residence was there, and Napoleon III also lived there before his coup d'etat, also used as a furniture depository, museum and even the National Printing Office, the Elysee has been the official residence of the French head of state since 1873. The president works in the Salon Doré, located in the centre of the first floor. General de Gaulle was the first president to install his office there. All around are the offices of the president's closest advisers, including the Secretary General of the Elysee and the Salon Vert, previously an imperial dining room, now used to host defence meetings. The eastern wing hosts the private part of the palace. Upstairs are the presidential apartments. On the ground floor, semi-official rooms like the Salon d'Argent, where Napoleon signed his abdication in 1815. In the official rooms, the President holds meetings and welcomes his guests of honour before official dinners in the Salon des aides de camp or Salon des Ambassadeurs. The Salon Murat traditionally accommodated cabinet meetings before François Hollande moved them to the Salon des Ambassadeurs. Official receptions, ceremonies and press conferences take place in the Salle des Fêtes. Inaugurated in 1889, it opens into the Winter Garden and Salon Napoleon III, formerly a private dining room decorated in the style of the epoch. Surveillance cameras and security personnel guard the Elysee 24-7. Since 1978, the basement has housed the Jupiter Command Center, a secure bunker from where the head of state can control the nation's nuclear weapons. <laughs>